Achieving harmony, understanding the balance of elements. Hello everyone, today, we're diving into an intriguing English language concept, the balance of elements. This phrase might sound a bit scientific at first, but in language and literature, it holds a unique and artistic significance. It's all about harmony and proportion, whether in writing, design, or any form of communication. Let's explore this concept together and discover how it applies to various aspects of English language learning. The balance of elements refers to the way different parts of something work together in harmony. Imagine a seesaw in a playground. For it to balance, both sides need to be equal in weight. Similarly, in language, literature, or art, this balance is about ensuring that no single element overpowers the others. Instead, everything contributes equally to create a cohesive and pleasing whole. This could mean balancing different themes in a story, contrasting ideas in an essay, or various design elements in a visual piece. In communication, the balance of elements is crucial for clarity and effectiveness. When we write or speak, balancing our ideas helps our audience understand and engage with our message more easily. For example, in persuasive writing, balancing evidence with personal opinions makes an argument more compelling. In speech, balancing seriousness with humor can keep the audience engaged without undermining the message's importance. Let's look at some examples. In writing, an essay with a good balance of narrative, analysis, and evidence is more compelling and easier to follow. In speeches, a well-structured speech that balances personal anecdotes with factual data is more persuasive and relatable. In literature, a story that balances character development, plot progression, and thematic exploration offers a richer reading experience. For English language learners, achieving a balance of elements can manifest in various ways. In learning methods, balance the four key skills of reading, writing, speaking, and listening for a well-rounded proficiency. In content, mix learning formal grammar and vocabulary with informal slang and idioms for a comprehensive understanding. In practice, Balance structured lessons with real-life practice, such as conversations with native speakers or engaging with English media. The balance of elements is a foundational concept that transcends language and infiltrates all forms of creation and communication. By understanding and applying this balance, English language learners can enhance their proficiency, communication skills, and appreciation for the subtleties of the language. We hope this video has illuminated the concept for you and inspired you to seek balance in your learning and creative endeavors. Thanks for watching, and keep exploring the beauty of balance in your English language journey.